Hi guys. Okay, so today I just want to do a quick test um, to see how much energy is being dropped by a slug. Um, we all know that uh, slugs carry the energy very far, but uh, they dump a lot more energy than a, a pellet. So um, I filled a bunch of cans with water, put them uh, in a row, and now I'm going to shoot them with a bunch of different slugs and a pellet to see uh, what the difference is and um, how fast uh, the slug and the pellet stops. Okay, so first up we have 18.13 uh, grain JSB. Let's see what uh, it does. Okay, uh, let's go and see how many cans it passed through. Okay, so the 18.13s uh, went through all of the can, so that is a benchmark. We will see if there is a slug that stops um, within uh, six cans. So, let's test. Okay, so first up of the slugs, we have the Inferno Rex 25 grain. Uh, this uh, slug is made to mushroom and to uh, explode and disintegrate. So let's see what it does with the cans. Okay, um, that sounded like a pretty solid hit. Let's go and see. Okay, so the 25 grain Inferno Rex slugs, uh, they went through uh, four of the cans. Uh, one is empty, but it just fell over. And the last one is still full of water. Uh, the slug did veer off a bit, um, but as you can hear, there are pieces of slug uh, in, in all of the cans. So, um, and that's a very, very big, very big explosion. So I'm pretty happy with uh, with these Inferno Rexes. They they really drop the energy. Um, so if you if you want to basically make something explode, uh, that's the slug to use. Okay. So next up we have the H and N slugs, uh, 25 grains. Uh, let's see what they do. Okay. Uh, that was the 25 grain H and Ns. Let's go and see what they did. Okay, so that was the H and N twenty five grain slugs. As you can see, um, a lot of <laughs> uh, power there. Um, really explosive. Second one is also uh, very uh, very torn open. Third one, fourth. Uh, one it just uh, penetrated and the uh, um, fifth one basically um, yeah didn't do much damage uh, at the back um, barely made it out so um, and the, <laughs> the last can is still standing so that's uh, five um, oh wait okay so that is literally five um, where's the camera that's literally five uh, cans and it just dropped and fell off. I will uh, make, I'll take a photo and uh, put it up, up here. Um, but wow, uh, so for uh, five cans, uh, H&N 25 grain, that's, that's pretty good. Um, uh, had a lot more energy than uh, 18 grain to begin with and stopped a lot sooner. So I'm really, really happy with these. <laughs> Okay, the next slug I'm going to test is the Javelins uh, 26 grain. So let's see uh, what they do. Okay, <laughs> that was a nice pop. Let's go and see. Uh, okay, so um, <laughs> what can I say about the Javelin slugs? Uh, I found the slug, um, okay, I'll also put a picture up um, up here, um, it completely mushroomed out, um, that's pretty crazy, and then you only see three cans. So can number one basically exploded, um, can number two 
it went through I punched a, a funny just just a bit of a hole and then in can number three that is where I found the slug went in did not go out so uh, javelin slugs they also dump their energy pretty pretty well um, okay so so far all of the slugs uh, dump the energy pretty well um, it depends on price and everything what you uh, what you want to do I still have one or two slugs to test so uh, let's do the final ones okay now it's the turn of the JSB knockouts um, we will see how they do okay JSB knockouts let's go and see what they did Okay guys, so that was the JSB knockouts. Um, as you can see, three cans behind me. First one ripped up uh, pretty good. Second one also uh, pretty good. This uh, third one had a hole there and then barely, yeah, you can just see it was just pushed open a bit. And inside number three, I found the JSB slug. So that's that's pretty good. That is uh, three cans. Um, it drops a lot of energy. Okay, uh, one last thing that I want to test is the Cro Magnums, the H and N Cro Magnum. Uh, that is a hunting pellet. So the um, the 18.13 grain JSB is a domed pellet. It's not made for hunting. It's made to be very accurate. Uh, this is a hunting pellet. It's made to expand. So let's let's see uh, what the difference is um, Okay, <laughs> there wasn't much of a boom or anything just for interesting Just want to shoot that back can just to see what it does Okay, that was a bit more satisfying uh, Let's go and see where I hit it if what happened and yeah uh, okay so the first shot uh well i found this the pellet um that hit a bit high uh, i hit the can <laughs> there so that didn't work very nicely okay uh let's try the um the chrome magnums again uh, let's hope we hit <laughs> eat it correctly Okay, that looked like a better shot. Let's go and see what it did Okay guys, uh, the Sun is setting now so um, yeah, it's time <laughs> time to finish up um, that was quite interesting to see uh, what the different slugs do and also the pellets um, I'm on my way to see what the uh, what the little um, Grow Magnum did so first can uh, second can started to be off it seems like um, okay so uh, it veered off again uh, unfortunately um, but I would say it will stop <laughs> uh, within uh, six cans if you look at the energy uh, that was dropped here um, so uh, what I think um, this is just my opinion um, the uh, the inferno slugs and the and the um, and the javelin slugs they really just explode they yeah if you want to uh, shoot um, pest birds or pest animals and um, you just want to see them explode. That's <laughs> that's a good good uh, slug to use. Um, if but uh, in, I think that if you're shooting something larger like a porcupine, um, then uh, yeah, it might not uh, might not do as much damage as the H and N slug. Um, I've shot uh, quite a few of them uh, with the H and N slugs, and they are just instantly down. They drop a lot of energy, as you saw from uh, from the cans. Uh, they still, yeah, they mushroom and everything. They just penetrate that a uh, little bit more um, to eat the vitals. 
so I really really like them they are crazy accurate that's uh, what I've been shooting um, in most of my videos um, as you've you've seen them um, that's basically uh, that the, um, that was the first time that I've shot the, uh, the knockout slugs they are also um, pretty crazy they drop a lot of energy um, I haven't tested the accuracy or anything um, in my gun with them I will do that uh, as soon as I have time and the weather permits but yeah, that's just my opinion. Um, I hope you enjoyed the video. Uh, if you have any ideas or comments, just leave them down below. And as always, thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.